What's going on here? Is this guy just shooting things at me? Like, I don't understand. Okay, yeah. Drop me down to two frames a second. Am I just supposed to beat this level with, like, everything going on like this? What kind of craziness is this? Oh my god, what am I supposed to be doing here? Oh my gosh, this guy is literally... What do I do from here? Oh, I see. Well, no. Do I see? Gosh, this is going to be a battle of epic proportions, I can already tell. I got a crazy, insane timed level. Plus, all this nonsensical jumbo. And he can just jump through the saws like it's NBD. Come on, start the train. My goal is to not get... Never mind. <laughs> I'm not gonna say what my goal was. Never mind. Ah, shart. Alright, come on. I hate that I have to wait for it. <sighs> Why do I have to wait for this? Like, it should just go. I gotta dodge him twice. And then I can jump down on these. Safely. About as safely as you could ever jump down on huge saw blades. Alright. There we go. Time your jump right. Good. Time your other jump right. Nope. That's not good. Man. Alright. Knowing this game, this is probably going to be the longest level as well. The longest and hardest. That was my uh, award I got in college. Or high school, rather. Longest and hardest. Yeah, baby. Ooh! Again, I sound like a dying basset hound. Not quite sure why. Don't ask me, I'm not quite sure. Oh, 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 oh. Oh my gosh, is there like a electric prodder on the end of that? I just saw that. Out of the corner of my vision. Okay, gotta wait for this. No, no, oh god, I'm dead. I'm completely dead. Yeah, there's no, there's absolutely no dodging that. That's for sure. All right, dodge it one more time. Jump in the middle of these. The outside of them. The rest is pretty simple. Up through here, and slide down this beautiful slide of meat. The only thing is, you have to wait for this, and they get like the the machines wait for you too. Nope, oh, but you gotta be so quick on that jump. Alright, come on. Oh my god, that one came back. The one that came back, not the one that got away. There we go. Oh, I seriously died on that? I died on that saw. Now I'm, now I'm coming into the anger stage of Super Meat Boy. Just because, more or less, I know that this is like the end of the game. Like, maybe the last level. Although, for some reason, I'm highly doubting this is the last level. But I want to give it the benefit of the doubt and say that it is. Why can't this guy just like ever miss his jump and then like, that's the end of the game? That'd be nice. A little mistake on your end. There we go. Oh no, get up there. Oh, that was an easy jump I should have had. Shoulda, woulda, coulda. The story of my... Super Meat Life. Meat Boy should write an autobiography. Just be called, gosh dang it. The Life of a Super Meat Boy. I don't see anything very super about you, except for you can jump and run off walls. I guess that's kind of something. That's something, isn't it? There we go. Oh yeah. Whoa, what's going on here? 
Okay, I guess I shouldn't try and fall down there. I don't know, I just panicked. Whoa, frames. There's so many... Frames, stay with me frames. They're not even dropping, I'm just assuming that they will. I'm probably, this is probably all leading up to like a boss fight or something. Oh my gosh, I can do that. What the fart knocker am I supposed to do there? Oh man. This game is, this game is actually just not meant to be beaten. Just like, you know what? Because actually when I saw him and I was like, oh, he'll be the last boss fight. What could he possibly be doing? He's not even doing anything. He's just that annoying guy in the background that's like flicking things at me. He's basically like that guy while well, I'm trying to th shoot the game winning free throw and he's the guy with the foam finger in the background like, herp derp derp. Like, man, give me a break. I'm doing all the work around Get your foam fingers out of here. I told you I don't want to buy your stupid product. Come on, this would be a perfect time for a Meat Boy dance. I'm dancing and I'm dancing because I'm waiting for these fancy saws to go around so I can jump. I missed my cue, but I still got it. So I'm a gosh dang Super Meat Boy. Alright. Whoa. Oh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, alright, new stage, new area, uh, <laughs> well that was clearly the only possible way to uh, go about that, and considering most of those jumps that I did to get through the last stage were complete luck, I'm sure we'll have much success in the future of this episode, this episode of Meat Boy Madness, whoa, alright. Good thing Meat Boy just stops. He could stop right on a dime. You'd think with all of his blood and guts of his previous life forms, it'd be a little bit slippery. It turns out. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. No. Okay, somehow it's still working. Works for me. Oh, I missed it by that much. That's all right. I think I've, I've pretty much got that second stage part down to a science. Or I guess is it the second? Let's see. This would I would technically consider this the first stage of obstacles. Every time that thing pauses, is I was I would probably consider a stage. So yeah, this is the second stage. So technically, I've gotten to the fourth stage, but I've only gotten past the third. So here we go, here's this. This is pretty easy now. This is, oh. Well, when you do that, there's a difference. Why are, this, why are his rockets like rainbow colored? Is he just trying to add insult to injury there? I'm not quite sure. It's like, look, look at my new rainbow rockets. Rainbow rocket, sounds like uh, familiar for some reason. Rainbow rocket. Can't think of it. Can't think of the reference. Probably because there is none. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Now, as I was saying before, never mind. Never mind, I'm never saying anything. Especially before other things. What? Come on, you with your noob tubes. Another one? Thanks. Oh, why did I jump there? I'm, I'm going into uh, crazy mode. I'm doing things that I shouldn't normally do. Let's try to get him to shoot up there. Okay, never mind. And there, and there. Down to it. Freaking science, this area. I'm not gonna die. I've made up my mind. This is the round where I don't die. Here we go. Up and at him. Wait. It's kind of, this is kind of an awkward position right there where you're just like chilling with your enemy. He's just standing there, reloading his rocket launcher. You're just standing there like, yep, I'm not going to fight back. I'm just going to fart. 
I'm just gonna fart all over you. Come on, me boy, can't you just fabricate some sort of weapon to combat him? Or, like, use some of these saws as, like, armor plates? What? Frames! Please! No! Oh god, they really are, uh... Are they gonna go out on me? Is this gonna be the end of the line? Because if these frames go out on me, that's not something I need around right now. Come on. There we go. Alright. Go ahead. Do your thing. No! Dang it. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. Can you hit the little floppy meat boy? Sure you can. You know you want to. Alright. Gotta be... Oh, dang it, the tricky part about this level is sometimes you gotta be fast and sometimes you gotta just be patient. And it's... It's never like... It's always a combination of the two. Which is kind of difficult. Because right here you gotta be super fast. Then you get over here and it's like, oh, you can you can relax. Everything's gonna be just fine. Just ignore these huge blades on either side of you and all around you coming to kill you. Alright, here we go. There we go. That was complete luck. And I'll admit it. Where are you, Dr. Fetus? Come at me, bro. Whoops. There we go. Oh no! What do you. You have to probably fall? Yeah, you probably have to fall there. I'm slowly figuring it out one step at a time. It wouldn't be as excruciating, um, I'm sure, if I got to where I died last, um, the very next try, but alas, this game is just, uh. It's besting me. It's besting me slowly but surely. But I will not let it get the best of me. Although I'm pretty sure those are the same thing. Here we go. Oh gosh, those are the worst deaths. It's just like doing that. I didn't even get that saw blade dirty. These saw blades don't even get meaty. What's going on here? It's a game flaw. Patch the game. Alright, never mind. I'm done. I'm done. It's okay. This this one isn't even timed. I'm sure you all have probably noticed that because after a while it's like it's like watching that during the boring lectures you always like notice things about the room like you count the number of lights there are on the ceiling or something like that so I'm sure you guys have all gotten so bored out of your minds that you're like counting you probably know how many tips of a saw blade there are on each saw don't you all right go just gotta wait a little bit and kind of guess at the same time <laughs> I really can't give a for sure strategy on that area no Gosh, I, I hate that if it kills me on a part that I just don't know what to do or that's like super hard then I can accept that but when I just run into a freaking saw after I've spent like 20 seconds getting there or more not cool man not cool at all. I totally haven't hit myself on that one blade. I shouldn't have even said that, to be honest. This blade, or have I? Maybe I have, I just haven't left my, a substantial enough mark on it. There we go. So when it's on its way down, you can drop down kind of safely. Alright, let's not talk right here. Yes, yes! Is this the boss? Oh my god, wait. Is this an actual boss now? Because that's going to be... Oh no! No, 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 what's going on here? What's going on here? What is the... What? what? Are you serious right now, you piece of crap? <laughs> you piece of crap? Oh my god. Uh, do I seriously like have to have a boss fight right there? Like, what's going on there? That's what I thought it couldn't get any worse. I at least thought it would be a different scene. 
Like, I at least thought it would cut the scene and be like, oh, you thought this was the last level? Well, too bad. But instead they chose the route of, oh, you thought this was the last part of the level? Well, too bad, because now you have to, you have to do a boss fight. Oh, that was close. That was close. All right, here we go. I've actually got it down pretty much, I want to say, at least. Yeah, okay. Back again. Round two. I'm not quite sure what to do here. Yeah, can I just stay here? Does that work? Whoa, all right. No! Mm, was that, like, the end? Because he, like, dropped and I stayed? How did that happen so fast? Before he, he like, kept shooting me with all of his rockets. Alright, I'm on a mission now. Round three. Dang it, I was gonna say round three in a row, but every time I want something to happen, it just doesn't. Except for right now. Witnessing history, I'm calling it. It's this run that will put me in the history books as the first person to ever beat Super Meat Boy while commentating in my exact voice. I'm breaking records today, guys. I'm glad you could witness it with me. That rocket never even gets close to you. Like, remotely close. Did you see that long jump I just did? It's gonna be a good one. I can tell. Look at me. I'm a well-oiled machine. I cannot be stopped. Not by this blade or any other. I will not die by the blade. Boom. Here we go. I told you. It's history. It's destiny. Oh, no, get up here. Do the thing that you did before. Oh, there's a button right here. I see. It's like actual Mario. Boom, baby. Die. Fall to your death. Oh, go stomp on that fetus. It's not the first time I've said that. No. It might look cute and innocent, but you must at least consume it. Half of you. Consume half of it. Oh my god, it had a really ugly death for how cute it was alive. Was that it? Oh no. Did he just use his n no fingers to flick me off? He has no fingers, and he actually made a middle finger. Oh god, what's going on here? Oh god, is this the uh, escape? Great. I have, I have Band-Aid Girl with me though. Oh man. This is not... Oh. This is going to be... This is... <laughs> yeah. Like I said, knew it wasn't the last level. But actually, I didn't know that. Oh, how do you get over that? That has to be like a perfect jump. You must execute the perfect jump. I feel like I'm in the very end of a Mission Impossible movie. What's going on here? That's not what Tom Cruise would say, but that's what I'm saying the heck's going on here? I have a mistress on my back. I don't even know how to make that jump, really. Alright, alright. How did I get... Oh, never mind. I was going to say how did I get back up, but I never fell. It was him. Alright, do I want to analyze this jump a little bit? There we go. No! Oh, there's so many saw blades. These weren't here before. Is this Inception? Is that what this is? Is this just all Inception? At least it's not like collapsing behind me, because that would make it real hard. Which is why I'm surprised that it's not happening. There we go. That jump is kind of difficult to make. Whoa! Alright. Sweet. Wait, what's going on here? Oh, okay, I see. I see. Here we go, making good progress now. Oh, this is gonna be a tough one. But I have confidence that I'll make it my first try. Eh. It's good to have hopes and dreams. That way you have something to mess up while you're playing Super Meat Boy, at least. So wait, did he like self-destruct his laboratory and like commit suicide? Is that what happened? I don't know. I, I always 
I can never keep up with those Super Meat Boy cutscenes. They're random even for me. But I'm gonna assume that's what he did. This part's not actually that bad. <laughs> I knew that was gonna happen. It's almost like my fingers just know, like, I start trash talking about being just a little bit good at a little part of the level, and they all collaborate, they have a round table discussion, and they're like, alright, we gotta set this guy straight. Oh, dang it. Now look. They're doing it. I know they're doing it. I can hear them scheming, and I can't even help it. Here we go. It's a battle against my fingers, dang <laughs> it. My fingers won that one. It's my thumb. The directional patties. It's most of the time it's him. He's just like, you know what, man? You are not that good, and I'm gonna prove it to you. It's the battle of the hands. It's the battle of Mr. Hands. Alright. Here we go. There we go, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Oh. Oh, I actually do remember this part. Would you look at that? Oh. Alright. I don't remember it being like this. Okay, this is going to be interesting. Oh, okay. What? Yeah, that's impossible with a keyboard. Guaranteed. Let's see. Okay. Throw something hard at me. That's, that's a popular line. Popular line at the... Uh, at my, uh, I don't know, I don't know what kind of joke I was gonna make there. There's a penis joke. Oh my gosh! Did I actually beat it? Did I beat it? I beat it. I got an achievement for the end. I have to have beat it. Um, please, please. Oh my god. <gasps> no! It's you from a long time ago that I don't remember your name? No, he's gonna die. No. <laughs> the dialogue for that would have gone something like, But wait! And he's like, Not today. It's not my time. The captain went down with his ship. How romantic. Honey, look at this factory I blew up trying to get your stupid ass. God. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> What's going on? It never ends. <laughs> oh my gosh. I beat the game, guys. I beat the game. What? What's well, one? Oh, wait. The squirrel. Making its return. I remember the squirrel. That's for sure. Anyways, guys. I beat the game. And, um, like I said in the comments. Let me know if you guys have beat the game as well, because I'm really curious, especially those out there who beat it with a keyboard. That's insane. But I hope you guys enjoyed. I finally finished my Let's Play of Super Meat Boy on a Sunday Funday episode. Um, crazy stuff. I would definitely rec recommend this game. It is actually currently, um, while I'm recording this, on the Humble Bundle, Humble Indie Bundle number four, where you can practically get it for free, along with a a bunch of other awesome indie games so I would really recommend checking that out but other than that guys um, I'll probably let the credits roll just in case you want to see all the bonus footage that's going on here but um and all my all, this is basically all my past bosses is what it's looking like just there you know they're checking in their their roll call before before we call it one heck of a let's play one of the most intense games I've ever played and um, like I said I really hope they make more more games like this in the future where it's just I can feel proud knowing that I beat Super Meat Boy maybe not a hundred percent find out in the dark world oh god yeah <laughs> I'm definitely definitely not doing the dark world I completely forgot about that until just now um, maybe maybe sometime in the future I'll play I'll play it through the dark world of like the really what is this? Cotton Alley? Oh god. Do I even want to know? Is this Let's Play not over? 
Please tell me this last play is over. Oh, you get to play as Band-Aid Girl. That's cool. I wonder if this is like an add-on. I'm, I'm pretty sure... Oh, I mean, we might as well. <laughs> who, who am I joking? Let's... Oh, God. This is probably... Oh, man. This is probably harder than all the other ones combined. Isn't it? Oh, my gosh. I can't believe I just made that jump. Yeah, are we, are we kidding ourselves now? What is this like? You would have to be Asian in order to just, like, know what you're doing here. I don't even... Oh my gosh, and the music they play really makes it seem like a 12 year old girl could, could do better than you at this. This is not Cotton Alley. When I thought of Cotton Alley, I did not think of this. Oh my gosh, now I'm not even trying, I'm just so aggravated. What? This is just insane. Alright, here we go. I just want to beat the first level in Cotton Alley and then we'll call it a day. Oh shoot. I screwed myself over, didn't I? Yeah. Yeah, I did. Don't worry, Meat Boy, I'll save you on much harder levels. I'd hate to end a Let's Play on an unfinished level. But seriously, I got to the, the credit screen, right? I mean, that's something. Maybe I'll just edit the part out where I was like, oh, what's this? Oh, I beat it. Or I beat that part. Oh yeah, found him. A plus too. Look at all these. Band-Aid girls just completely annihilated. Alright. I'm going back to the map. Maybe someday we will look at Cotton Alley a little bit further. But um, other than that, guys, I'm definitely going to cut this video off. Um, I hope you enjoyed, and I don't know if I'd have to get like an insane amount of requests in order to in order to keep this going for Cotton Alley. Maybe on a maybe on another Sunday fun day we'll do Super Super Band Aid Girl. That'll be a, a new rendition. Um, but uh, I hope you had fun watching me finally complete my Let's Play kind of, and I will see you guys next time. Peace Nuggets.